again. I'm right here. And I promise, I'm not going anywhere. I wish Mira was here. And Asha. And... And Roderick. I do too. But Mira's in King's Landing and... Can't she come home? I don't want her to die too. Ryan, she's perfectly safe, I promise you. I don't want Gareth to die either. Maester Ortengrin said he got sent to the wall. I'll miss Garrett. He was nice. I don't know what he did to get sent away like that. He'll be fine. Garrett is smart. Garrett is smart. No one will tell me what Garrett did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Royland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Everyone's worried about you, but I'm not. I know you'll protect us. Who said they're worried about me? Well, Sir Royland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? Um, the motherfucker. Your I'll kick him right in the arse. Sir Royland forgets himself. He underestimates he me. me or, or what I'm capable of. What does Milksop mean? I don't know. But I know it's not good. Ethan, you should let Sir Royland teach you how to wield a sword. Like... Like a man. <laughs> like a man. He Roderick and Asher, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. A lord should know how to fight. <laughs> Do you remember when we were younger? When we all used to play here? You, me, Roderick, Asher. We'd all be out here for hours. Yeah. Where was I? You weren't born yet. Oh. We had so much fun. But then... And everything changed. Roderick became so serious, the Lord in training, and he never smiled anymore. And Asher. Asher just got angry at everything. Promise me you won't be like that. Please, just be you. I like you the way you are. Oh. I know a Lord has like many me? responsibilities, but you don't need to be like them. I promise I won't change. Good. Because I'd rather have a brother than a lord. You'll have to have both, I'm afraid. But since you're the new lord, you can do anything you want. I yes, suppose. sir. Everyone will have to do as you say. So I could have all the sweets I want. If only it were that simple. It would be nice if someone did what I wanted for once. But Ethan will be a good lord. A proper lord. You have to understand. Being Lord is a great responsibility. I can't just fool around. Thank you for that, Roderick. What? Is there another thing to say? In the great hall at once. Quickly, on your feet. Man, I really gotta be careful what I say in this game. What's the matter? Lord Whitehill has arrived. Unannounced. And certainly unexpected. He's gone demanding justice. Uh-oh. Can't he meet with Duncan? He is the Castellan. Stay with us. Please, Ethan. He's demanding an audience with the Lord. We really must go. Nah. It's your decision. You are the Lord. If I were Lord, I would command you. Ah, uh, I will have to go with them. Fine. If that's what's required of me. Very well then. We showed up unannounced. Lord Whitehill is in a lather. I assume you explained to Lord Ethan why they're the here. The business with Garrett. I told him. Lord Whitehill knows Garrett is a squire to this house. Or was, I suppose. Is. Was. It makes no difference. The Whitehills were clearly in the wrong. So don't give him any satisfaction. Out there, you were decisive and firm. Now do it again with these bastards. Let's not do something rash. Things are bad enough as it is. 
throw him out the gate myself if you let me. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already is. He's got five times as many men, and the backing of House Bolton. All the more reason to stand up for ourselves. Only cowards and dead men rule over. Lord Ethan, is it? My condolences for your father and brother. The late Lord Forrester was no friend to me or my house. My only regret is I wasn't there to drive the dagger into his heart myself. I've been waiting for this day all my life. The Foresters finally get their due. I may be young, but I'm not so easily fooled. They're trying to rile me, but it won't work. Young? You are that boy. Too young to know when you're in over your head. And no bread and salt! What kind of fucking house receives a lord with no fucking bread and salt? You bloody amateur. No Can I kill him? Is. I should have expected as much. Bloody foresters. Fetch Lord Whitehill some bread and salt. It was an oversight, Lord Whitehill. I promise it won't happen again. Not likely. You foresters have shit on us for generations. Well, now the Starks are no longer around to have you back, are they? We're the power in the North now. Roos Bolton is the Warden of the North. Aye, and we've been his bannermen for five fucking centuries, you cunt. How dare you? Lord Ethan, you're losing control of this. That's enough, Lord Whitehill. I'm not finished. Maybe if you hadn't been so fucking greedy with the ironwood, things would have been different between us. You squandered your share. Our share was taken from us. We had no fucking choice but to harvest what was left. What is it you want, Lord Whitehill? Yeah, your God. man, the squire. We were minding our own business. Keeping the Bullshit. Keys, as his lordship here said. When your man attacked us for no reason. Hear that? Attacked for no reason. No reason? You murdered his family. Then you admit it was your man who killed my men. And a pig farmer at that. How do you answer for your squire, Lord Ethan? He acted in your name. And you are the lord of this house. He was defending his family as any man would. But your men... Murdered them all. You lost pig farmers, not soldiers. Soldiers worth a hundred of their type. Where's the fucking coward who killed my men? I know he's here. What have you done with him? He was sent to the wall. Who the fuck sent him to the wall? Answer me. Who's the one who did it? I did. What? That was my justice to deliver, boy. And you denied me of it. So leave him until I have my justice. Uh oh. That now bring me the coward have... who did it no or answer. To Roos Bolton. What kind of fucking house is this? A house of honorable men. Lady Forrester. You bellow like a wounded boar, Lord Whitehill. Have you forgotten your manners? Oh shit. I mean no. Now he's all quiet. You, my lady. Considering your losses and all, but this, this is not over. Okay. It's over when my son says it is. This is over, Lord Whitehill. Ethan is Lord of Ironrath now. By rights, his word is law here. If that displeases you, then I trust you can find the door. Oh shit, son. That lad may be Lord of this house. Lord Bolton will have the final say. I'll send him a raven letting him know a Forester man killed one of his own. That the new Lord Forester lied to my face and denied me my justice. Then we'll see whose word is law. We're in the right, Lord Whitehill. Remember that. Oh, he will.
I don't like him. Your son did well, my lady. He kept his wits while Lord Whitehill lost his temper. A lesser man would have been rattled, but Ethan here held his ground. You were brave, my son. But Thanks, you need Mama. To be braver still when Ramsay Snow arrives to see you bend the knee. Prepare a raven. We need to send word to Mira in King's Landing at once. Your sister can help us. Although just a handmaiden, she has Marjorie Tyrell's faith. Mira Forrester, Red Marjorie Keep, Marjorie King's Landing. The king may be enough to keep the Boltons at bay, if it's presented to her as it should be. Hi, what's this? Asher sent me this coin, to remember him. What a strange place, Essos. Ethan made this for me. Father. Much excitement here in King's Landing for the coming wedding. Lady Marjorie has proven to be quite popular throughout the city. I do wish you and Mother could come. Although I know it would be a Okay, so this is somewhere in the middle of the seasons. I miss all of you. And I around season you three to four. Just so far they haven't shown you the main characters yet, so it's hard to tell what's going on. Wonders Made by Man, by Lomas Longstrider, a gift from Roderick. I hope to see them all someday. I know I did. King's Landing. I wonder if it's sunny at Ironrath today. It troubles me to even ask this of you, but you must appeal to Lady Marjorie to intervene on our behalf. She is our best hope, and can be a powerful ally, especially now when your family so desperately needs her help. Coming. Hold on, hold on, let's get... Like, can I get any of the fruit? No. Fuck. Alright, whatever people want. One moment. Oh, sorry, milady. I, I didn't mean to disturb you. I can come back later if you'd like. No, it's fine. Come in. Oh, look at the little guy. Begging your pardon, lady, but you are right. If you don't mind my asking, you seem rather upset. I'm just worried about my family. Ah, letter from home, is it? It's kind of you to ask. Of course, milady. You've always been kind to me. Please hurry if you can. Lady Marjorie will be here any minute. Of course, milady. What is he even putting in there? You work for Lady Marjorie? I may be wrong, but it seems like you do. 